We're now just hours away from the first in the nation primary. The first votes will be cast in New Hampshire tonight at midnight. Nick Giovanni's live in Manchester this morning with more, Nick. Kate, Chris, good morning to you both. Air Force One and Air Force Two both bound for New Hampshire on this, the eve of the first in the nation primary. The Vice President, Mike Pence, scheduled to fly into Portsmouth and then make his way here by bus to Manchester, where you can see behind me a line has already started forming for tonight's Keep America Great rally with President Trump inside SNHU Arena. In fact, people have been camping out since last night. I spoke with a group of Trump supporters here this morning who were talking about how this has been a great week in their mind, fresh off of the president's acquittal in the impeachment trial. We're the swing state, you know, sometimes we're blue, sometimes we're red. And I feel like with over the past couple of, you know, years that people are really seeing that Trump really is for America. And what I like the best about Trump, and I tell this to people who are on both sides, is this right here, his heart. On the Democratic side, meanwhile, the front runners are going to be sprinting across the Granite State just like we saw them do this weekend, doing as many get out the vote events as possible. Bernie Sanders has stops planned in Ringe, Nashua, Hudson, and Durham. Pete Buttigieg is heading to Milford and Exeter. Elizabeth Warren is going to be in Rochester and Portsmouth. And Joe Biden is scheduled to go from Guilford to Manchester. All of these candidates eyeing the undecided voters specifically as they make their final pitches. We're going to set the pace to win in Nevada and South Carolina and California. We need to start getting Washington to look a little more like our best run cities and towns. So back live, the final countdown is officially on to the primary, which officially gets underway at midnight in Dixville Notch. Number of polls open at 6 a.m. tomorrow. For now, we're live in Manchester, New Hampshire. Nick Giovanni, WBZ This Morning.